Guys, what's poppin' and it's Savage Ready back with another video and today we are still vlogging on the camera but we are using something different. Um we are actually using it's not selfie stick because I don't use selfie sticks so it's like I'm not a selfie person, if you know what I mean. Is that too close? I'm sorry guys. Like, you know, I'm not like like a girliest person, like you know, like I, like it's 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 not a selfie stick it is some type of like like as you guys can see like it's um like a little thing that you use on a gopro like you guys see like look look how uh, how tall you guys are now see that so yeah it's kind of like a extendable one when i get outside i'll probably show you how it how high it actually goes but um before we get into this video i want you guys to go subscribe to my friend savage aiden um and that's my pretty much shout out for the intro of the video so let's go outside okay guys so we are back out back and um maybe we'll do a drift trike update because i haven't updated you guys about the drift trike yet it's really a beast the clutch not working so it's really you can't really drive it because it can it's really dangerous because you can catch yourself on fire because of the clutch because it spits spark it spit spit sparks when you go full throttle so it's kind of dangerous because you can get yourself on fire but I was going to show you guys how tall this can this thing can actually get that I'm using right now so let me stretch it out okay you guys ready Wait, let me kind of aim it down a little bit so you guys can actually see me. Yeah, that's how high it pretty much goes. It goes really high. And um, let me try and get you guys back in. Right now, I'm sorry. It does, it's pretty hard to get back in. But yeah, um, let me work in the garage. Yeah. Um, let's turn on the light. Oh, actually, yeah, sorry, but, um, okay, um, we actually have, so where is it, there, it's the go-kart right here, um, like I said, it has the Honda, you guys have seen this before, you guys seen it on the, um, drifting go-kart video that I did, this is the go-kart we used, we got those bucket tires, Cut them, cut the bottom of them off, put them on the tires, and drift it around. This has a Honda GX31. It's a four-stroke motor. Um, and maybe we'll get a startup for it. But let me come show you guys my tractor. Now this is probably they don't make these tractors anymore. I think so. It's pretty rare, but it also has a lift kit on it. It's my tractor. Yeah, like you guys saw my first first video ever made that I used it um it's this my tractor um it's an orange old like rug rat I forget I forget how what's what you pronounce it with it's like a really old tractor though and it actually used to be really low to the ground like if like you were riding like a I know like a regular lawnmower just really low and it's really small so we did lift it up, and um, we went through many of motors. Here is the exhaust we have coming out of the exhaust, right there out of the cylinder. Um, comes out and it goes into the muffler, as you guys can see right there. It comes up, so that comes out. Um, it, we have gone through so many motors with this thing because it is crazy. So that's the old gearbox, as you guys can see right there. That used to be the old gearbox. And this is the motor we, that we're using right now, and it also has a fuel tank on the back. Yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty cool. Um, let's get the front of this on video. I mean, this is the front of it, and we'll probably just like bring them outside so like you guys can see all of it. Um, yeah, let me show you guys all the motors that we've gone through for this. Um. I don't know if these are all the motors, there might be even more, but there's one right down there, 
you guys see that one right down there that broke the pool so you guys know like with the motor like with the gas motor how like like if you have like a water pump or something or a generator how you have to pull the string to start it like that pull string broke off so we actually had to use if you guys know like i think like what they use to like put like on car tires and stuff i think we used that to start it and um that's another motor that we use and um that motor actually i i believe it was that motor um yeah it was that motor definitely um it blew oil on me um the oil pan came up splashed oil all over me it was it was crazy yeah it, it, it wasn't that good of a time i almost i could have got like burnt because i was covered in oil and those smoke fire like you know so i had to shut down the tractor actually i didn't shut down the tractor my dad did um, it was cause one of the nuts, not in a weird way, um, one of the bolts, I should say, yeah, probably bolts, um, came up in the, in the pull string part where it, if you had the pull string, I think that came up, like that part came up and it also brought up the oil, the oil cap too, I think, so oil spilled everywhere gets all over me, smoke starts going, I hop off the tractor and was slipping off because there's oil everywhere. Um, my dad shuts it down and I was covered in oil. I had to get in the shower, it's crazy, but um then we have the old Honda that you guys probably remember that used to be on the drift trike. Um yeah, so I guess like we should line them up to see like how they are and stuff like outside. So yeah guys, I'll see you guys when I do that. Okay, guys, so we have them all lined up one by one. And I'll probably tell you who is the fastest, because I know. It's one I'm looking at right now, but, yeah. Um, the go-karts, just tell you, probably the slowest. But, um, so, let's start. So, first we have a go-kart right here, the go-kart. This was, um, actually was not ours at first, actually, my dad was working on this exact go kart. Um, it was um, the tires were different though. We got new tires for it. Um, it um needed a lot of work, and it was my dad, boss's son, son's go kart. So we had to fix it for many a time. So the chain kept popping off. So we needed to tighten it with that. Well, um. Then, there's too many problems with it. The spark wasn't, I think it was something with the spark plug wire. It wasn't running right, the spark plug wire wasn't. So, after that, so we just, um, got it. He said he didn't want it anymore. He said it was too much work. So we got it. Um, It's a Honda GX31, I think. I got that right, yep, Honda GX31 four-stroke motor, um, I believe it was built for a high school project and found in a dumpster, so if you guys are wondering why it looks like crap, that's, that's why it looks like, damn weird stuff, <laughs> okay, the airplane, okay, that's cringe, so, um, let's move on to the next one, so the next one, you guys know, we have the drift trike. Now this one has a tractor tire on the front wheel. Um, as you guys can see, the brake pedal, this brake pedal, and they're cheap brakes that just go to the wheel. As you guys can see, like, oh, well, I'm so what? You guys can see right there. That's how you brake. It's them. It's a Honda. No, no, it's not. It's, it used to be a Honda GX on it, but um, it was a Predator 212 motor. Um, it is 212cc, like I said, it's a gasoline engine, most of you guys probably know of, let me pull for it, it's hard to pull, but yeah, I like, it's pretty cool, um, where we got the Honda GX from, go Power Sports, yes, put the sticker on there, now, let's move on to, to the tractor, now you guys all know my tractor, it's like that, um, it's broken many times. Um, 
And yeah, it's pretty cool. It's been broken many times, like I said. Um, and yet, <laughs> I don't have much to say about this. There's a fuel line, though. Right there, it goes right into the carburetor. And yeah, so um, if you guys haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you do not miss any of my new important fun videos. I don't know. Um, drop a like and comment down below what you want me to do for 40 subscribers because we are almost there, guys. So, if you guys please subscribe, the next two subscribers will get me to 40 subscribers. Only if I could do a giveaway for the last two subscribers. That'd be cool. But I need to figure out how to do that. That'd be hard. It'd just be mailing something to somebody, you know what I mean? So, um, yeah, so. The last two people to get the 40, please subscribe. Like, just please, if you just are new to this channel, just please subscribe. Drop the like so it's seen by more people. Comment. Like I said, what you want me to do for 40 subscribers. Notification bell. Do not miss any of my videos. Subscribe to my friend Savage Aiden. And, um, yeah, I guess I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.